right, guys. Hello, hello? All right, well, today, if you want the recipe yourself, it is lemon cheesecake Miss cookies. Miss Yato just resubscribed for 11 months. Makers are so loud. Six ounces of cream cheese cold, three tablespoons of granulated white sugar. Here we go! Half a tablespoon of lemon zest. What's in the What's white in box? The box? This? My cocaine. Uh, what did I walk over here for? Oh, let me go back over here so I can think. What was I about to walk to go get? Bruh. I don't know. I don't know what I was about to grab. Oh. We need half a tablespoon of lemon zest. Cream cheese, six ounces. It's pretty much <laughs> half a tablespoon right there. Get a little extra lemony. Three tablespoons. Nobody reads this dream titles. It's okay. okay that's one, two, three. So this is the filling of the cookies. Making this cream cheese with sugar and lemon zest. Roll these into little balls and then it'll go into the freezer for a little bit. And that will be in the middle of the cookies. Add the cream cheese and sugar to a small bowl. Mix on medium high speed with an electric mixer until fluffy and the sugar has dissolved about two minutes. Oh, then mix in the lemon zest. That's okay, you know what? We're just really doing it our own way. This might be a little loud. Sorry, so sorry. Almost done with this. Then these gotta sit in the freezer for a little bit. Add the cream cheese and sugar to a small bowl. Yep, did that. Scoop the cheesecake filling into 16 two teaspoon portions. Okay, that works. 12, 16, okay. Now these go in the freezer. All right, lemon zest. Half a tablespoon, fill this up. That looks like half. Half a cup of granulated sugar, half a cup, yep. Rub the lemon zest and sugar together with your fingers. Okay. Flour, baking soda, baking powder, and salt. Flour, baking powder, baking soda, salt. Can I just save this image? Oh, I can. Let's <laughs> see. I can direct you to what we are making. One three-fourth cup, all-purpose. I don't have a three-fourth, so I'll use a one-half and a one-fourth. That's correct, right? I don't have a three-fourth measuring, so I can use a one-half plus a one-fourth. Math wasn't my strong suit, just, just letting you know. Nice and easy, half. One half teaspoon baking powder, one half teaspoon baking soda, one half teaspoon salt. Not measuring by weight. Well, I mean, it says this is eight, this is four. <laughs> it's okay. I didn't do very well in math class. Put these into the microwave. Let's do power level three for 30 seconds. Three fourths cup of brown sugar, one fourth cup granulated white sugar. Three fourth light brown sugar, packed. Oh. Well, that's a little, that's a little solid. Yeah, I'm not bothering with that. With an electric hand mixer on high until fluffy. Headphone warning. I'm giving you a warning this time. Very nice, nice and mixed. I need to get like an egg separator. Would this work? Look at this dude. Would the yolk go through this? Baga. I'll just use the eggshell method, it's fine. Mix for one minute on medium speed. Earphone, ah. earphone. I can't speak today. Add in the lemon zest and combined on medium speed. Two and a half tablespoons. Oh, one more lemon zest. 
Lemon zest added. Add in the dry ingredients and combined on low speed. I think I might just pan add in some of the dry at first. Chill the dough for 10 to 15 minutes. Get both ovens going. Make it faster here. I just want to try to get 16. I would have given up at this point. Just eat the dough. I, it's taking a lot of uh, willpower right now. I do, I do want to eat this dough. It's not really rolling into a ball at all. These really like don't roll very well. It's just like all over my hands. We're getting like less and less of a ball shape here. Pretty good, 16 right there. I'm so excited. <laughs> I'm so excited for these. Okay, this one's a little tiny. Add a little bit more to this one. <sighs> Covered. Here are the cheesecake balls. Man, this does not want to go flatten. Okay. Nice. Roll it into a ball, then into the sugar, then onto the tray. Cheesecake ball. Make sure there's spaced enough here. These need to go back into the freezer. This into the fridge. Set the timer for 10 minutes. 10 minutes later. They are kind of they are big. Dark pans also absorb heat. There's so much I gotta learn. Baking is scarier for me than cooking. You just make one very small, tiny misstep with baking and it's, it's done. It's all over. Look away for 0.5 seconds. Burned. It is a science for sure. Let's see. Oh yeah. Oh. Move farther away. I need to learn how to take food photos. It doesn't look good from the top. But that is gonna be it for today. But I hope you enjoy the rest of your evenings, mornings, afternoons, wherever you are, and I will see you guys on Monday. Okay, bye.